It was early 1900, and it was a world of iron and steel. I was a philanthropist, an actress. I volunteered in World War I. I was a campaigner and believed in equality, and I fought for those rights. I ran for Congress, but never got a seat. I was fluent in many languages. I received a French Foreign Legion honor for my efforts for helping people with different languages during and after world's worst maritime disaster. My parents were Irish immigrants. I knew what it was like to be poor. Growing up Missouri, being broke made me dream of marrying a rich fella. Luckily, the man I married struck it lucky in the gold mining business. I set up soup kitchens for the miners' families and fought for their rights as well. I worked with Judge Ben B. Lindsay to establish juvenile court system so kids would get a fair trial. I was also a suffragette. It was so hard to be heard as a woman in a man's world. My grandson was ill. I left Egypt and boarded the Titanic. History recalls me as the unsinkable Molly Brown. And this would be the night I would get that name. Hey there, Sonny. Save your engine until we get on the lifeboat. I think a color you can wear out of the place. Well, we got to impede my stroke. Well, McCauley, at 700 miles to shore, so you wouldn't want to do anything to impede your stroke. Women and children to the boats. Boat six is ready. I'm gonna report you to the White Star Line, you brute. Come on, put your backs into it. Pull. The ship, the suction will pull us down if we don't get away from it. Now, pull. Pull. Frederick, you're not pulling evenly. Sorry, sir. You look like a duck with a broken wing. Ain't you ever rode a boat before, Sonny? No, ma'am. Give me that oar. I'll show you how it's done. Now, Come back! Come back to the ship! Put your butts into it. Come back to the ship! Stop. We have to go back. No, we're not going back. The suction will pull us down if we don't keep going. Why not? There's plenty more room in this boat. No! I'm in charge of this boat, madam. No matter where it's our lives now, not theirs. Freezing, they're gonna die. If we go back, they'll pull the boat down and capsize us. They're dying. I say we go back. Now, women, grab an oar. We're going back. Do you all want to die? Let's go. Grab an oar. Now, for the last time, we're not going back. There's no reason why we don't go back. We can't have that in our conscience. Oh, keep your mouth shut. We've got plenty or more on this boat. What's the matter with you? There's plenty more room. At least 30. Now let's go. For God's sake, woman, you won't shut up. We have to do something. Now everybody, grab an arm, we're going back. I've told you before, I'm in charge of this boat. Now keep your pie hole shut, or I'll be throwing you off this bleeding boat. At 4 
a.m. on Monday the 15th of April, 1912, the Carpathia came to our rescue, and we were saved.